What's up, boys? It never fails with me. I, every time I go to Home Depot, this time I went for screws. That's it. But I go wandering around because uh, I wanted to get a, a backboard for this this uh, display rack I made for somebody. They flaked, so I'm going to keep it. What I wanted to do was uh, put like a hard piece of hardboard in the back and paint it. And, I don't know, put in tools or something. We'll see. I found... I saw this thing, it's a pegboard on the uh, scrap bin. Oh, I forgot the dimensions of it, but it's a big old piece. Uh, it was marked down 70 percent, so I think I got the whole thing for like two bucks, two fifty or something like that. I already have these hooks, and I had my tools hanging in in the old pad, and. Uh, just got a crazy idea. Maybe I can fit like six of them. Seven. Seven hot wheels fit comfortable right there, so I'm I need to get more hooks. I can do the whole board. I have material to make a frame behind it. So I'll do that in a bit. I need to get more uh, more uh, peg hooks. Home Depot so sells them a dollar a hook. I think I know where they sell them a little bit cheaper. Alright, three hooks for two bucks. I should have enough now. So let me get um, now. What I need to do is make a a frame for the back of the uh, pegboard, and um, then nail the pegboard to the frame. So let me get that going. Here's the frame. I used the uh, three quarter inch by one and a half inch material and just uh, put a couple of pocket holes for the joinery for you woodworkers out there. I'll put the, uh, the dimensions of this in the description. This thing's gonna be huge. So what I'll do next is um, is cut the pegboard to fit the frame, and then uh, and then glue and nail on the uh, the pegboard to the frame, and that should be done. Then we'll be ready for the hooks, and I'll show that next. There it is, man. I outdid myself with this one. This thing is huge. 35 hooks. 7 across, 5 down. Unreal. I was going to do a small version of this, but this works for now. I put it uh I put it behind my workbench. It'll work. Again, I'll put the dimensions for this one in uh, in the description. And if you want to make something like this, I mean, just measure, do your measurements, go get the material, and just get at it. You can just make a a frame for it, nail the pegboard onto the frame, put some hooks on there, even just two rows. 
This one's cool. Wanna see it filled up? Let's do it. Let's fill this up. Hold on. There you have it. No BS, guys. There's eight cards in each hook. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight per hook. 35 peg hooks. Dude, that's 280 Hot Wheels right here in this board. On real. It's cool, man. Keeps them out of the box. At least I have them up here. There it is, guys. Thanks for watching. Post any comments or questions down below in the comments. And um, I'll post more pictures in my, uh, in my Instagram. The name will be in the description. Along with the mentions and all that stuff for this board. I'll leave you with another view of all this stuff and... Uh, I'll talk to you guys later.